Hi, I'm Madam Aisha and I'm a mother of two children, one in Sec 3 in Springfield Secondary and my daughter is in Telukura Primary. Okay, being an ex-teacher, um, I, I thought Springfield Secondary was just like any other ordinary neighbourhood secondary school until three years ago when my son was in P6 that I started uh, looking in depth at the different secondary schools around Tampines and I found that Springfield had some good things to offer which the other schools didn't have. One thing that struck out was uh, they had a robotics group as well as they offered computing as a subject. Uh, these two things were things that my son enjoyed and has a passion for and that was why we chose Springfield Secondary. Okay, this is his third year. He's in Sec 3 this year. And uh, to be honest, I find that he is more independent now. He's self-directed in wanting to do well. And uh, when he has a problem in terms of his studies or projects, he does not give up. And I think that is uh, one key thing that I believe he has learned from the school. Okay, um, I remembered last year, uh, he had a geography project where they had to go to Tampanese Hub to take photos and to, uh, to find out more information. Now, some members of his group couldn't make it on the days that they were meeting up. So they went separately, they decided to go separately. They took the photos, they did the reading up and then they just transferred into the Google Drive uh, for the main person who is doing, for my son to do up the slides. So I thought that was a good idea. So even, if, even though you didn't meet in person, something uh, a big project like that could still be done. Yeah. Computing, and uh, he enjoys maths, so he's doing double maths, e maths, and a maths. Though a maths is a bit fearful for him because being a new subject, but uh, because he's aiming to go to a polytechnic, and uh, we've laid down that you know a maths is one of the things that he needs to take up if he really wants to go on that path. So I think he's doing pretty well, but computing is his forte. Uh, I think he just likes to, to play around with computers. And I think uh, in computing, they learn uh, coding language, Python, which is something new to him. And I believe it interests him. Um, my son is someone who would um, meddle with computers. If there's something wrong with the computer, you give it to him, he'll be meddling. And then after that, it's okay. Yeah. Okay, um, I joined the... Uh Springfield Parents Network uh, in, when my child was in Sec 1. Okay, I became the chairperson last year. Now, in uh, we are very closely coordinated and we are very closely knit in SPN. We work together with the two vice principals, okay, namely Mr. Bambang, who has left us, and Mr. Chan. Uh, to me, they're just a phone call away at any point of time. Any of my members, if they are in doubt of any policies or any changes uh, in the school curriculum or the school uh, policies, they could just ask in that chat group and I would uh, immediately ask Mr. Chan and he would come back with the response from the school side. So it's a two-way situation. Like recently, uh, we had a kind of dialogue via Zoom where Mr. Chan, Mr. Uh, ba I'm not, sorry, no, Mr. Fuad as well as Mr. Sebastian joined us and at that platform many questions were raised and uh, the three of them answered at least we were happy that uh, our concerns were addressed. I, I find that Springfield does have a holistic approach. It is not just uh, academic or just CCA, it's a combination of both. And uh, they do help those who are in the CCA. That means if they're, if they're representing the school and they miss out lessons, I think the school comes forward and helps them out. Uh, in terms of CCA, they have uh, uh, Taekwondo, where I know it's one of their fortes. Uh, having, having students who have won even the national champions and having students who represent Singapore overseas and the outdoor pursuit, the rock climbing. Okay, I think, again, not many schools do have that and uh, one of the reasons why I'm trying to convince my daughter to come to Springfield to go for the outdoor pursuit. Okay, of course besides looking at your child's aggregate, you need to look at each different school of uh, the plus and the minus, what each school offers. Okay, what school A offers, maybe school B doesn't have even though the aggregate score is about the same. Um, like in Springfield, there are a lot of classes like the Taekwondo CCA for example. Uh, 
I know that they've won many national awards as well as uh, they have students who have competed under the Singapore banner overseas. Uh, the Outdoor Pursuit is one of the very rare ones around the East that I know of and that's why I'm trying to convince my daughter to come to Springfield. Uh, in terms of subject, they do have uh, one that stands out because even for me, I'm interested in computers. So computing is one and I know uh, in the East, not many schools offer that. Okay. Uh, the most important thing would be the teachers actually. I find that the teachers are caring. At any point, you can just approach them. Uh, they are just one phone call away and you don't get many teachers of that kind nowadays actually.